Welcome back to CoachRob.com. In this video I want to discuss and illustrate how to handle trigger points in the chest and the front of the shoulder. What I want you to realize is that all of your muscles in your chest originate from your sternum, dead center of your chest, and the muscles run laterally up to and insert in the front of the shoulder and underneath the armpit. Taking a tennis ball, what I'd like you to do is I'd like you to start massaging the ball up and down and this is what we refer to as cross friction massage. Because the tissue runs from the center of your sternum laterally to the shoulder, I want you to take the tennis ball moving up and down until you find a trigger point. For those of you that use your chest for a lot of various activities, uh, weightlifting, swimming, things such as that, you're definitely going to find more than one trigger point. So feel free to take your time and move around until you find one. Now what I want you to realize when she brings her arm up like that is I want you to see how she's moving the ball up into the shoulder region. There are several muscles that insert in there and you're bound to find a point that's what we call a hot spot. Where she's putting her fingertips there is to illustrate how the pec major goes up and into the front of the shoulder. And that is one of the areas that you'll find one of the most typical trigger points. You can actually look at a trigger point chart online. Now once she finds the trigger point, I want you to notice how she stops and I want you to notice how she's breathing deeply and as she exhales she puts a little bit more pressure down on the ball and she interrupts what's called a pain spasm pain cycle until the trigger point lets go. Then she begins to move around the chest looking for more trigger points. If you have any questions about this or any of our videos, please visit me at CoachRob.com.